Good morning and welcome back everyone to Dapper Dell Farm, where we have our work cut out for us today. There's no one's birthday, so we don't really have to do any kind of socializing if we don't want to. Uh, what's the weather forecast? It's going to be a beautiful sunny day on the morrow. That is a very good thing indeed. What do we need? We need... Uh, there's one particular mushroom that we do not have, and that is preventing us from doing awesome things. Uh, you know what? We don't need to put the cheese in there. That's fine. Peppers? Yeah, I'm gonna keep peppers in there. Some more pepper poppers is what I want. Yes! I'll take five of them. Then I will add uh, more cheese. What do we use for pepper poppers? Oh, there we are. Just more cheese. Another five. Yes! And more. Yes! And even more. Aha! This is going to fuel our day for a little while. I'm actually going to drop these off. So let's pop that in there. Okay, let's go. So, pepper poppers. Pop. Super speed. We've got many things we want to do today. We've got a mill, which is kind of a good thing. And do we have anything we can see gather down here? I don't believe so. We've got some poppies over there. We've got some more peppers down here. That's good. Let's grab these up. We don't need to do any kind of watering around here anymore. Which is Grand. Grand in the most awesome of ways. Uh, let's see. I should probably side this. There we are. I'm not going to worry about the rest of that. But I do need to make some tree taps. I especially need some tree taps for the pine area. My lord. Actually, while we're here, let's gather some hay while we can. Also, a couple of walls. Because we're going to need them, let's be honest with ourselves. These down. I do need to uh, drop a couple of these things off. So today's going to be a farm day. We may pop into the village at some point, but by and large, my focus today is going to be about the farm. Just getting everything sorted. Really? There's a tree growing in. Really? Another tree? Oh, you scoundrels. Both of you. Get out. All three of you. Oh, the invasion has begun anew. We only stole the invasion by slaying so many of the pine trees over on the other side. They've been waiting, gathering this around three arm. Oh, there's another sneaky one in there. You thought you could hide? No. My eyes see all. All right. Ooh, got some extra quartz over there. That's not too bad. And let's go ahead and load this up as well. I really should bring my other uh, crab pots over here, honestly. Let's go ahead. Just grab these. Alright, have we got anything else that we can use? I think we've got a couple more eggs, actually, yeah. Let's get those going. Well, as much as I had planned originally to put down a bunch of beehives over there, I guess we just never got around to it. So instead, I'm just going to use this area as a bit of a grass growing field. Let's get all of that done. There we are. Uh, we're going to need a couple more of these. Just for here and there around the farm. Right, good times. Now, Snuffkin, where are you, my friend? Hello. Oh, look at that little tail wagging. Go and say hello to the girls. What is up, pal? Hey, uh, Robin. Be patient, I still have a lot of work to do. I'm not. Uh, what? Why do you always assume that I'm nagging you to get things done first? And I was just saying hello. Even a good neighbour was going to offer you some tea. I'm such a good neighbour, I may have even offered you some coffee if that's really your poison of preference. There we go. Come on out, everyone. Enjoy. Let's go and milk the beefs. Just move those down. And in there. Hello. Oh, Abigail looks big today. Oops. There we go. Thank you very much, Bill. Right, Bonnie. I assume. Evelina. I also assume. Aha! I am awesome. Best mama. I can tell my goats apart, even when they are literally identical. It's how it's how they they walk. You see. Hello. Abigail, still a baby. Here we go. Henwen, still a baby. 
Never mind. Let's get you all outside so you can enjoy the sunshine and the grass. Alright, let's go and uh, drop these off though. Ooh, fantastic. Some wires for me. Those going. And drop all of this off for now. Uh, I've got room for one large egg though. I think. Yes, I do. Right, what are we going to pop up there? I think we're going to go for more hops. Just try and get rid of some of the hops that I've got. No, oh, come along. Really? Did I not? Oh my lord, I've got loads of these things that I didn't put anything in. Ah, oh, my brain. My brain hurts. My brain hurts with all the wasted time. Uh, why did I do that? I do not know. Alright, well, at the very least, I can go and drop some of these off. I'm going to go and drop off this snail straight away. You can go straight in there. Then I am going to go and drop off a bunch of the random projects that I've got. So these can go. Oh, I didn't drop the parent because oh well, you're over there now. The clam. Um, the grapes can go actually. Something the wheat. Thinking about it. Ooh, you know what I should do? I was going to just work around the farm. However, beets. Where have I put the beets? I put the beets somewhere. Akasha, I need your help. We have got to go get Mayor Lewis's beets. Whoosh. There we are. Beets, beets, beets. Apparently, I flat out don't need to put them in a certain... Um, all of the same quality. I can just place a, a total of beets in Mayor Lewis's fridge. So let's go do that. We'll start making progress with that quest. I think I'll swoop by Clint's as well. Grab a bunch of stuff. I would very much like... Oh, hey, guys. Hi, Vincent. Sometimes I look for crawdads in the river. Well done. Hello. Um, the mountains look nice today, don't they? Yes, they do. Vincent? They are. Miss Penny makes me read a new book every week. You should be lucky. Feel so lucky. I don't get new books every week. Right, let's see. Hello, me and Lucy's fridge. You quickly place the beets in the fridge. Wait a sec. There's a note taped to the milk. It's addressed to you. Good job, kid. Your final task. Give the sand dragon his last meal. It's the key. Now. Unfortunately, a couple of people have already told me what this request is. I appreciate the effort to uh, give me give me help. At this point, I'm not going to pretend I don't know what it is. It was kind of hard to avoid that spoiler because a couple of people have given it to me. Ooh, hash browns, yes. Thank you. And all of these as well. But yeah, I'm a little bit... I kind of would have liked if I had been afforded the opportunity to work that out myself. Genuinely. Thank you, though, for, for trying to help. Right. Hello. How are you doing, Alex? Mm, I smell barbecue. Really? I don't. But then I can barely smell anything right now. Damn it, I'm too old to do anything exciting anymore. All I have to look forward to is years and years of sweaty hot furnace work. You're only as old as you think, mate. Right. Shop. I would like many coals. Then many coppers. Um... Actually, there we go. There we are. That'll be enough to get me everything I want in terms of the copper I'm going to need for... Oh, what's going on there? It's just key. Give the sand dragon his final meal. That'll give me everything I need for the silos I want. Ooh, so more copper. Fantastic. Right, well, the cash, eh? Ooh. Hey, Haley. Seems like a good day to go swimming. Sure. It, you know, any any sunny day is probably a good day to go swimming, depending on where you live. Hello. Be careful out there, dear. You could get sunburned. Oh, I will endeavour to avoid this fate. Right. Well, whilst 
the AIs off, you know, plotting the destruction of Earth. I better, you know, make the most of the time I have. I'm going to pay 500 gold to just quickly go to Calico Desert and finish this quest. I have got to deliver to the Sand Dragon final mail, which apparently is... I assume this is the Sand Dragon. It's more gapes of the desert sun. Even in death, it yearns for a taste. Oh, actually, that that is not nearly as bad. I assumed this was just a random thing and people had tried all sorts of things and eventually someone had worked it out and then you posted it. But honestly, if I just read that, I would have first guessed Solar Essence. You place the essence in the dragon's ball. Only then do you notice a note hidden in the eye socket. You're proving yourself, kid. Check out the pile of lumber next to your house. Mr. Key. Really? Do you need to make me have to run back and forth, back and forth like this? Hello? Well, since I paid all that money to get, get over here, I'm going to pick up a couple of things while I'm here. Let's grab whatever this is. A coconut. I will also grab whatever's in the chest. Yeah, I haven't got the most inventory, unfortunately. But do I have... I do have a sweet pea. Fantastic. Sandy can have that then. Hello. I would like all of these things. Thank you. Bye. Ah, that one pepper popper. Still going strong. Still got 30 seconds of pepper poppery goodness. Wiggly works. Hey, Sandy. Hi, welcome to Sandy's Oasis, the number one destination in Calico Desert. Here you go. I absolutely love getting flowers from the valley. I'm so happy. You're welcome. Did I sound professional? Yes. Yes, you did. Make sure to check out our seasonal seeds collection. I will. There's nothing really I want to buy, I'll be honest with you, but maybe, you know, since I'm here, I'll buy some food. Bar. There you go. Take care, Sandy. Stone. Well, I could always use more stone. Right, we're heading back. It's 4 10 pm. We have done well, reasonably well so far, I would say. Now, the pile of lumber next to my house. Okay. Akasha is wondering where you've been. I've been to the desert, Akasha. It was a grand trip. Okay, that's the pile of lumber next to my house. Okay, well, before we do anything with that, let's let's head on down hither. Grab some of this awesome stuff. Uh, do I have anything else? I do indeed. Get all of these working. Don't want any freeloading cheese presses in my farm, thank you very much. And all of the mayo as well. No. No. I know what's happening. My inventory's full. Damn it! Uh, hmm. Find somewhere I can drop things off. Just for now. I will also then take these, and I will also take this, and then I will make a bunch of bombs. There we go. And these can be dropped off. There we are, nice and easy. Then I can finally get you out of the way. Right, well, I've got a couple of things that I can drop off. I'm going to leave the peppers here. Uh, the spice berry, yeah, sure, I'll leave the spice berry there as well, I guess. Uh, anything else particularly... No, not really. Alright, start to work on copper. And while all that's doing its wonderful stuff, I'm going to go and start the harvest, actually. It's time to gather all of this. At some point, I need to jump into the greenhouse. Do all of the watering in there. But we'll quickly grab the hops for now. I want to see how many hops I end up with, because... I'm going to need a lot of those kegs in order to make use of this many hops. I genuinely don't think I'm ever going to need this many hops, honestly. So, up here. This trellis area was perhaps... Well, maybe it was a little bit uh, overzealous. I mean, if you had something like this early on, like in the first year, wow, you'd still be making pale ale in year two at this point. You'd probably never need to do anything else. It would be glorious. Alright, let's 
swinging down. This will also give me an opportunity to check out whether the carpet is ready. Yes, it is. Fantastic. And dropping off the hops once again. Okay, yeah, we've got stupid amounts of hops now. And uh, can't drop that off in there. We'll drop it off there instead. And then the cashier. Let's go and check out that wood pile. Oh, we've got some honey to collect as well. Excuse me. Thank you. What did I just get? What? Another piece of wood. You found a club card. I'm not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. Oh, I've got a good idea of where that needs to go. I suspect that's for the, uh, the place with the bouncer that I can get into. And if it's not, I have no idea where it's for. Right, let's go ahead and close the barn. We don't need to open anymore. And also fix up some of these walls. There we are. Oh, yes. Right, what are we going to find in here? Nothing to harvest just yet, which is a crying shame, honestly. But I'm going to go ahead and get all of this watered. Then we are going to go and... Hmm, I would like to actually work on the flooring around the lower farm, honestly. And if I end up liking the design that I go with, I'll copy it across to the upper farm as well. 7.40 p.m. We're actually not that far into the day. We could perhaps go swing by the saloon. Maybe even play a, an arcade game. Oh, no. Arcade game or two. Grab this. There we go. I was apparently extremely close to winning the pra uh, Tales of the Prairie King before. Or Adventures of the Prairie King. I forget. But I was nowhere near close to winning Junimo Kart, apparently. That seems to be a much harder game than I was giving it credit for. Now, hopefully, when we get all of these harvested, we're going to have so much money, it's going to be ridiculous. Uh, let's drop off this. Um... No. no we'll, we'll leave this. We'll, we'll get it later. Uh, anything else? No, not really. We seem to be good. Oh, really? Scoundrel you. The other thing I would like to do is gather these poppies. I don't think we're going to have time to plant anymore, but it's nice to have them. They'll be... Well, actually, they won't be decent gifts. That's the problem. Is they flat out won't be. People just don't seem to like poppies in this town. Maybe uh, reminds them of something uncomfortable. I'm not sure. Well, let's go grab you. And you, and you. There we go. Perfect. And we'll drop these off. That is going to be enough to get one silo done. And once we've got those done, we'll have enough to do two. Anything else we need to drop in? No, not really. Ooh, we've got a jam. Then in that case, uh, let's just get this out of my inventory down there. Oh, pale ale as well. Fantastic. Ah, all of the things at once. Nope. There we go. Do we have enough room? Yes, I do. Now, the nice thing about the pale ale is they all pretty much finish at the same time. I dropped the copper off now. Uh, but I'm not going to be able to drop it off in there. That's fine. I'll make a chest specifically for metals, the ores, and the uh, finished goods. Right. Now, what is it I need to use to make a tree tap? Just 40 wood. Ah, really copper? No. I need those two silos. I just flat out need them at this point. The same with the kegs. I can't make them right now. I could, however, make some more preserved jars. We got enough coal. Easily enough coal. I made a point of buying a ridiculous amount because we tend to use coal up in larger quantities. There we go. We'll just get this done. There we are. Drop this tree down as well. Go grab you. Move this across. Alright. Now then. 
as I was discussing previously, actually, we'll get this set up. It shouldn't actually take me long. We'll decide if I if if it's a good design or not. That in there. Because this way we would be able to have some lighting around here as well, which is something that we don't easily have right now. And I could get rid of these because I'd have lighting in the corner areas around the crops. You know what? I actually think I like it. I actually think I like it. I think we'll be sticking with this. There we go. Got some stuff I need to collect from that side. How's the time? Well, we're doing alright. Could be doing a little bit better, but overall it's okay. Now, of course, up in the north field, we are going to need to do something just slightly differently because we have it joining up with the trees. Nope. I want to eat the maple syrup. Who would just eat maple syrup? Just just flat up, just, yeah, yeah, I'm hungry. I'm going to eat maple syrup. That just sounds dumb. Oh, fantastic. Just in time. No, that was the right one. I shall take you two. Thank you very much. You're coming along with me. Can I make one? Yes, I can. In that case, you go there, and you are going to have... Um, ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. You can have... Sure, a blueberry. Alright, let's get out of here. I'll sell what I've got left in my inventory. Take a cash all the way up the top. Come out, cashier. I do need to uh, speed up a little bit at this point. Add these two. There we go. Shouldn't be a bad night, profit wise. Right, we'll drop off the honey. All of the poppies need to go. I should probably drop off those hops as well, actually. Anything else? Yeah, we'll get rid of that too and then this poppy as well. Alright, good to go. It is pretty late though, but we've only used a half of our energy. Not star snuffkin. Ah, good times. What have we got to do tomorrow, if anything? Uh, nothing at all, it's just a flat out Sunday. Awesome. Okay, time for snoozings. And we made over 12k flat up with this. The hot pepper wine. Hot pepper wine? I wasn't expecting it to make wine, I'll be honest with you. I was imagining it would make some sort of juice. Or sauce or something. But the pale ales, not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, the hot pepper jelly? Yeah, it didn't do particularly well either. Yeah, I don't think we want to use hot peppers in those again. We'll just use it in cooking, so I'll just sell the peppers, I guess. Uh, the poppy honey did quite well, though. Alright, anything else? Uh, yeah, actually foraging didn't do too badly. Fishing, not bad either. Okay. We are actually raking in the cash at the moment. This can only be considered a good thing. Now, we're back up to 16k. Now, I've no idea how much rabbits are going to cost, but I suspect it's going to be a lot. Uh, let's actually check on... Well, let's look at our status. We're over three quarters of, mi of a million total earnings. That is particularly nice. We'll see if we can crest the million before the, the game's end. I suspect we will be able to. Whatever you are, I don't know. Perhaps you're a purple cabbage. Yeah, I imagine you are, actually. We'll see if we can sell these other things. We'll have to have a look at that. But we've got a couple more things that we can sell around here. Quite a lot, actually. Wow, okay, we're nowhere near ready to complete that particular collection. Fish-wise, we're not actually doing too bad. We've caught most fish. Artifacts, yeah, there's loads. Absolute loads that we need to get. Uh, how are we going to do that? We've still got that bloody scroll to get. Minerals, not so many. We're only missing a few of those. As far as cooked dishes... Oh well, millionaire, earn one million gold. 
a complete collection. Complete the museum collection. Gourmet chef, cook every recipe. Living large, upgrade your house to the maximum size. Craft master, craft every item. Oh, shipment, ship every item. Polyculture, ship 15 of each crop. A big help, complete 40 help wanted quests. And master angler, catch every fish. Maybe we'll be able to get some of those done before the game ends. I'm not sure we're going to be able to get all of them done, though. But that's going to be the end of this episode. As always, if you have any feedback, do leave a comment down below or a like on the video to let me know you'd like to see more Stardew Valley in the future. But until then, do take care.